everybody welcome to back to my channel I hope you guys are having a great uh, 11 hours 11 11 on the clock and I decided to start this video because I figured maybe we'll have some pretty decent vibes okay I done cleared a lot of energy and uh, just want to basically express and express uh, my thanks to you guys first okay before praying and asking my guides and my spirit team to come in to the reading and uh, I'm at the message that's what I do I give messages I'm a messenger a traveler and a messenger when it comes to me uh, you know sharing information well today or this evening tonight I should say wherever you guys are I don't know where you are but where I am it's 11 11 right now and uh, I don't know where you uh, all are in the world, but I'm sure you're not that far. And uh, and I just want to say, uh, welcome back. That's the first thing I want to say. Okay. Um, I have so many different downloads. You know, like we all do, uploads, messages, information, spiritual information, you know. I have so, I just, have whatever you call it, you know, let it resonate. But anyway, I know it was uh, sent and then delivered. It was definitely asked for, you know, because I'm always seeking divine guidance and everything. Like I said, I'm not, uh, I'm new to sharing my uh, experiences, uh, spiritual life you know, with the public, because that's what we do. We publish this for the public, okay? Um, so I'm not very good at it. And so, yes, it makes me a little bit nervous because I know what I'm dealing with, you understand, but without being amongst a whole bunch of spiritual people who can actually target me, you understand, for whatever reasons, you know, but spirit wanted to talk to us, 144 who has experienced so much energy harvesting uh people energy harvesting off of us you know and for whatever reason may it be uh um you know just to just because they uh need some spiritual um energy basically that's what source is saying because they need spiritual energy they don't have any you understand? They are not fluent in it. They are not filled with it. That's what I hear Source saying. Okay? But definitely, guys, I want to um, thank you and welcome you all back. Okay? For sure. Um, the next thing I want to do is I want to give a disclosure that, uh, you know, let people know, first off, that this channel is not for children. Okay? 18 and up because it's not in the description. My description is there to describe um, what I'm all about and what may be talked about here, what may be said or spoken, okay? Uh, subjects, titles, people, who all may be here, okay? Or where you can find maybe some information, if not all information regarding any of those things. But I first want to say that I'm not by any means, though, uh, rendering any type of medical services or giving any medical advice, nor... Uh, should anything I state, I repeat, nor should anything I state take the place of regular scheduled appointments, whether that's by a psychiatrist or a primary care physician, a specialist, which is a healthcare professional of any kind, okay? Uh, no warranty is, is offered here, okay, for anything that's said, okay? Because again, a lot, uh, and I'm going to get into why I today had to uh, record a disclosure, okay? This has something to do with just a portion of this um, a segment, okay? Um, but anyway, no warranty expressed or implied is delivered by the content of my work under the counsel of light in the spirit of my ancestors, God, uh, those ascended masters of the highest divine, uh, most highest divine light, and my spiritual team. That's my uh, son, my law, you know, just everybody that's involved, okay, with my enlightenment, 
all right? So I do want to uh, provide you guys with that disclosure. I do want to say again, this channel is not for children, okay? Um, and then I also want to state that I do curse because I pick up energies, okay? This need to be explained, and I'm going to do this at every video here on after because, again, Source told me to speak, and this is the time and the hour that Source has me doing that, okay, regarding several things. I got a lot of medium messages that came in over the last uh, probably two days. It's been so many people coming through as I uh, accept uh, uh, many of the sequential changes that's going on in the uh, universe right now as uh, uh, portals of my ascension. You understand uh, where I'm healed from a lot of things. In other words, right now what's going on in the universe is a, a constant uh, a post-shadow retrograde moment for me. You understand? In other words, I'm constantly going back trying to reckon with the things that were shaking up, okay, during other cycles in my life, okay? And it's not by my might that I go, because I don't go alone, but it's by, um, it's under certain orders, councils, uh, you know, all of that stuff in, uh, in this, on this planet. And, and actually my spirit uh, is, has cried out for a lot of healing. You know, understand what I'm saying? So again, um, you guys, I do want to provide you all with that disclosure. Again, I also want to say to anybody that has any type of a, a reading addiction or, you know, being on channels and stuff, going to people every day, y'all like y'all just, just, this is like an everyday, all day thing. You can't do nothing else. You can't, you know, if you got, cause I mean, people wanting to know stuff, especially people who are psychics, people who have uh, psychic, I should say, sources say, say psychic abilities or intuitive abilities. That's the better word source want me to use more often uh, since I'm on TV. Uh, he, uh, my team is saying you're on TV, so you have to use certain words, and I get that. Um, but anyway, um, source wants y'all to know y'all have not been abandoned by God, okay? I'm getting that right now. Sources want me to tell you guys that somebody that's for somebody out there. Okay. You just you you have not been abandoned by God, okay? Not at all. Okay. But what you are what you are experiencing, sources said, is a journey. Okay. You are on a soul journey. Okay. And so when you're on a soul journey, you have to be dedicated to the energies and the shifts that happen when that happened to you. Okay, so I do want to say that and put that out there because that's cutting right into my next thought. And I want to get that out and I have to learn how to just be, um, just pause sometime because it's, it's a lot that will come through. And again, I have an overload right now. I'm actually purging so many things uh, to the point where at, right after I get off of the um, TV and everything, talking to you guys or whatever... I often want to just run right back and get back on because here comes something else. But it's not that's not how we go. And we're going to talk about that again. Uh, I'm going to get back to that because that's going to resonate. Uh, it's something else. I have another message that's going to resonate uh, with that too. That's very, very important. Okay. But first I want to, uh, I want to give honor to God who's the head of my life. I want to thank everybody that comes to this channel. I want to also... Um, Ask those guys and ascended masters again, the Council of Light, the ancestors, you know, just my spiritual team, period, to um, be here with me. Because, again, Source is letting, uh, to, wanted the collective to know that you have to be seated. You have to, you have to ask them. You have to invite them. You understand? You have to invite your team. You have to ask them. You understand? For, uh, uh, to be present sometimes, you understand? Because sometimes we will assume that we in a certain power under a certain authority and it, it's not what we should be doing uh, without permission, okay? You get permission, okay? That's the respect of the elders. And I want y'all to know that that major arcana does not play, okay? 
It doesn't. The remnant doesn't either. But the and that's what source just. I just heard some say the rem, I just got. Yeah, I just channeled that. The remnant either. Okay, because there's a lot of things in the minor arcana that leads to the major arcana. You understand? It allowed that journey allow you to reach that um, uh, that place uh, inside of yourself where again you understand where you dedicate it to your light energy I should say okay where you are a humble messenger of love and light that's what I hear source saying um, I'm getting okay um, <clears throat> so um, basically um, right after I show I want to I do have to say that right after I um, uh, 1044 on the clock um, right after I show my physical face on the channel, um, again, I'm very, very sensitive to energy, and I always have been, okay? I was 12 years old. I'm 51 years old. I was 12 years old. I'm very proud of my age. I'm so thankful, especially after losing a son that was 24 years old, 11, 11 on the clock. I must, you know, understand, express the gratitude of the years that I have in my life. You understand? And, and again, I don't want anything that can't reach me where I am right now. So, and, and, and so, you know, just, just being thankful for each and every second that I'm here, 11.33 on the clock, I'm thankful. Okay. Um, but, uh, anyway, uh, I had to take the video down. So, um, it was just 11.44 on the clock when I said that. Oh, my God. But anyway, I had to take the uh, video down because I had to. I was instructed because of not being prepared for the energy, uh, you know, for clean, for, for the tax. I wasn't, a, I wasn't prepared for the negative energy. I did receive quite a bit. I felt it, okay? And uh, I took it down. I mean, I could put it up now. It doesn't matter because, again, I was instructed on how to ground myself for this thing. I wasn't prepared. I really wasn't prepared. I mean, I wasn't prepared for the... I mean, Source said I was prepared, but Source said that there was there's certain shifts in that energy that that in in so many people's energy that happened so fast and these are spiritualists they said baby you've been dealing with religious folks all your life you've been dealing with different different you know that kind of stuff you've been uh we've been uh channeling in energy and channeling messages and stuff like that uh, you know having you channel messages and you know just Again, just being my great escape from low vibrational individuals. You understand what I'm saying? Who feel like they can energy harvest off a motherfucker. Who feel that they can take something um, from them or, you know, excite their, their own lives with someone else's internal life. Who they're internally, their internal being, their internal existence, you know, I think is fucked up. That's all I can say. Don't let the smooth taste fool you. Don't let the baby face smooth uh, fool you. Don't let the the goddamn uh, uh, smooth skin. That's what I just heard. So, so said, see, somebody mad about your skin was too smooth or something. I don't know, but uh, I got a lot. My ancestors and and, and uh, I had fighters in my family. You know, like the ones that passed away. I think about how my sister. They called my sister Mama Dog back in high school. She was a rapper and shit like that, big time. Uh, was a boss. That's all I can tell you. She wasn't no chump, you know, not at all. She wasn't no chump, you know, so I say that. That's what I hear her saying. You ain't no chump, you know what I'm saying? And I wasn't no chump, you understand? That's what I wasn't. I wasn't a chump. That's what I heard her say. So I just want y'all to know that, um, y'all, I'm on my journey and I wouldn't take nothing for it. You understand that? When I tell y'all I'm in a situation where I'm in my life right now, and in a place in my life, I'm trying to tell y'all where, um, you know, I'd rather have wisdom, y'all. I'd rather get wisdom. I'd rather get them downloads, y'all. I'd rather get that wisdom, y'all, than over anything. You understand that 1444 was on the clock? I'm just trying to tell y'all. I don't play about God. I don't play about my spirituality. It looks like I don't play about my house. 
keeping it clean and shit like that, taking care of my belongings. You understand that? That's right. I, I, or, and my kids. I don't play about none of them. Them three things there. And when I was married, or when I, when I, my heart has been, uh, when, when I was married and my heart was, was, was where it was, you know, it was some balance. So it's just saying, where, when, whenever you're in a relationship, just say whenever you're in a relationship and, and, and it's balance, you don't play about it because you're constantly trying to keep it that way. You know, you're constantly trying to maintain that balance. Okay. So I just want y'all to know that, um, uh, be careful. And that right there in itself, how many messages, uh, how many things, instructions I was given for grounding myself and uh, getting rid of the neg some negative energy that tried to attack me and stuff. Um, I had to do so many things. And, uh, and, and for me to have to have done that, and because of that, as Source was, and my team was working with me and stuff and on me, you know, lead me. I mean, had me in a rage doing doing things because I needed to get it off of me, okay? And I hope I sent it back. That's what the fuck I hope I did. That's right. I sure in the fuck said that. Yes, I did. I hope I sent it back, okay? Because first off, I'm, and you'll, you'll see why I said that, okay? For those people who say, well, you ain't no better than that person or you shouldn't have did that because you don't know what all they did or whatever. No, I don't know what all the fuck they did to have me feeling like I felt. You understand what I'm saying? To have me uh, feeling like I felt about the picture, how, how uh, YouTube had my mouth open and chose that picture to post for it to go across the goddamn screen and all that. It was just a lot. Source pulled out and my spiritual team did. And they said, this one right here, this one right here, now I got a message for you. We wanted, we needed that. We needed you to do that. You understand? So you can move forward and then in a lot of things. We needed you to do that. You understand? Everybody that then experienced that, okay? Everybody that didn't experience that, had had to had 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 got messages. You understand on how to get rid of certain things when that happened. Okay, now not everybody. When source said everybody, it wasn't everybody. Okay, because everybody ain't real light workers, and everybody ain't one forty four, and every motherfucker body ain't real spiritualist, and everybody ain't really here for the right for the real reason or the right reason. Okay, that's that's the way I feel. Okay, and I know that that's true. Okay. You ain't gonna go in every church in the in the goddamn world and ain't gonna walk into and gonna walk into somewhere where you gonna receive a message. You gonna get a download. You gonna walk out feeling a certain type of way. Everybody, everywhere you go for word, for message, for instruction, for guidance, covering, just to purge. Period. You understand? Lay your burdens down. Whatever you go in your religious or your uh, spiritual self for. Okay, it's gonna be fluctuations. Cause again, like I said, it's energy. It's energy, y'all, okay? It's vibration, and we're going to get off into that as well. But again, I want to thank you all for um, uh, being here with me. Click like and share. And uh, I want to just uh, tell everybody to stay encouraged. And again, source is saying, repeat it, that you have not been abandoned by God, okay? And that's what I want y'all to know. Uh, the divine is and has assigned a soul journey family for y'all, okay? And and, the, and this family is going to be dedicated to y'all light energy, all right? So those motherfuckers is out here throwing shit at you, you know, making you feel, you know, a, a certain type of way or even just messing with your throat chakra and shit sometimes. So it's going to try not to get them no recognition. We got to stop saying, oh, somebody, because I do that because I know, I mean, we know, we, I mean, we, we intuitive, we know, you understand? And then our, uh, again, our guides and our ancestors, I'm hearing my, my, uh, I'm, I'm channeling you, you, uh. You know because we're we're here. You know because we watch and you know because we see what the fuck you don't see and what the fuck you think, what the fuck they think that we don't see and you don't see. We see it, okay? So just know that those that light energy is that you know they is your journey your spirit family soul journey family. I'm sorry, are very dedicated, okay, to y'all. All right, so stay encouraged. All right. Uh, 
source also wanted y'all to know that uh, this is for somebody. Let it resonate, okay? I'm being told to go there, okay? Because I, I just be expecting everybody is ranked a certain type of way when I come out. And so I just, like, sometimes it's, I be rambling and stuff. But it's it's protection. Because I'm going to tell y'all something, and that's a part of the message as well. Y'all got to be careful what y'all putting out and what y'all sending out and saying to people. Because because some of it, sometimes, is too detailed, okay? And y'all be knowing, if y'all intuitive, that y'all got motherfuckers sitting around y'all table that's murderers. Y'all have y'all have people in y'all, uh, in y'all, message sessions you understand uh you know sitting on side of y'all i'm getting sore to say you understand that who whom are dangerous people and they're there because again some of y'all are psychic investigators some of y'all are you know i mean real real powerful people in the spiritual realm you understand 2103 on the clock in a spiritual realm y'all to the point where people can sniff y'all out and they say, hey, we know this person going to hit. You know, they going to tell me if anybody, if it's anybody that I can find out what this bitch or what this Negro doing, you know what I'm saying, or this motherfucker, uh, you know, male doing, you know, what the divine film uh, or the divine mass is doing, you know, then, um, and I do curse. This channel is, again, I said it's not for 18-year-olds, and that's because I channel energy, y'all, okay? I channel energy. Okay, and I'm learning how to place a lid over it. You understand? While I'm when when it get too full, when it when it's too combustible, when it's too toxic, I'm getting so I say when it's just too fucking toxic. Okay, sometimes you gotta just pull back from it and leave it alone and go back to that good energy that's there. You understand? That will help renew you, help get you to a certain place. Okay, and keep you on track. Okay, where you don't abandon your duties. All right. So anyway, um, source wanted somebody to let it resonate, okay? Let this resonate, y'all, where it do, okay, sweethearts? Let it resonate, okay, people, uh, you know, um, them cross-watchers, whatever, okay? Let it resonate, all right, uh, where it does. And again, take the gender. When I talk, take the gender off, okay? Take the gender off. Even when I flip the cards, it may be a woman. Source is telling me to remind people on a card, you may see a woman figure. You may see a man figure. But it doesn't have to be, if it's a card with a man on it, it could be a woman. It can, it can apply to either gender, okay, basically. Um, Source said, give them the ash track. Give them, ab give them abstract and not full text. Uh, you so detailed. That's what I heard. And I am. I'm a very detailed person. So that's it's very hard for me to, because I want to reach as many people. And I understand that everybody don't learn and comprehend the same. And it's because of who I am and whose I am that I do that. You understand? Because I know what I'm out here to do. All right? Uh, for everybody that went into the house of the Lord today, I hope y'all said a prayer for me. That's all I want to say to certain people as well so uh so i have like i said i have so many uh messages and they're going to be uh, some of them are going to be specific um and some of them aren't i also want y'all to know that if i say it ever say a name in any of my messages do not steal if uh like for instance if i say uh, a name the name like um uh just say if i say tracy Tracy could be a man, it could be a woman. Tracy could be uh, spelt with a Y or I-E, okay? So, again, we you won't, res you won't, you won't, um, you want to feel something, okay? When somebody's talking to you, you want to know, you want, you want proof, you understand? Basically, it's like if I walk, if I sit in, if, if I get a reading from someone, or I'm sitting and listening to a message of someone's, and they say something that's resonating with me. Usually, it usually it resonates because within seconds, maybe minutes, days, no longer sources saying than like three months. Okay, okay, no longer than like three months. Normally, it, 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 it's 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 a product. Okay, of your story of your situation and it's applying to you. 
remember some messages are timeless okay and when you give a timeless message you understand uh, you have to allow one day at a time okay to bring about the ramification okay the um, confirmation I'm getting source okay and the clarification of certain things as well so don't internalize everything that you hear on platforms okay source wanted me to say that so it's also wanted me to say that um, um, the light energy of this planet is very miraculous okay very very miraculous you understand and um, we live on a miraculous planet that's what I hear source saying we have a miraculous planet to dwell upon and um, it's not the planet it's the people and it's their vibration okay know that the world needs you the world needs you guys okay and it's a lighter place because of you all okay I had to write some things down y'all okay so I had to, to give my messages I don't want to miss anything okay and so and I don't want to just have them all the time because of the rambling and you know me just being into my authentic self trying to um, talk to you guys um, from a certain place all right okay let's take off my sweater I threw this sweater I had this sweater sitting in this chair uh, come sit down now sit down sit down lay down you ain't in your cage right now but you're gonna go in a minute okay lay down girl so um yeah so just uh bear with me guys but i tried like i said i did some writing because i be channeling so much and then again by me uh, receiving so many medium messages and stuff once I open myself up and stuff like that and you know I, it, it, they so many so many, much conversation that's all I can say and I and I have to write I'm writing I was instructed to write it down okay for right now until I'm able to sort that's what I was told until I'm able to sort okay um, uh, so anyway, um, thank you all for allowing me to live my dream. I do want to say that. So I said, go ahead and tell them what you told me um, and everything. Um, and I want to just thank you guys, those that's going to support, those that's going to uh, have positive feedback, give positive feedback. And um, those who truly um, uh, recognize, uh, you know, my empath empathic uh, spirit and soul okay I want to thank you guys and also uh, all my ancestors guides and uh, angels and ancestors my oracles my African goddesses I just want to thank y'all right now as well you know first and foremost you know for being light in my life um, so I just want y'all to know that source is always here Y'all ancestors want y'all to know that they're always present. You understand? They say that um, this soil uh, is too fertile for them to uh, watch y'all and pay attention to what's going on for you, for, for, with you guys. Um, and this is for some of y'all from uh, too far, from too far away. Okay? And that's for someone who's been uh, who's recently lost somebody who's been wondering if that person or uh, those people are near them or around them your ancestors want you to know that okay uh, they're always around they're always around okay they're always around they said that they can't they can't interfere with free choice I mean free will they can't interfere with your pathway they can't interfere with your purpose but what they do is they encourage they instruct okay and they also um, eliminate to they can take away certain things okay that's what they said um, source wants somebody to alleviate some of the fear that they're having surrounding uh, uh, just being on these platforms 
okay? And that's like I was saying before, it's something you have to, it's a whole different thing because, again, we don't fight against flesh and blood, but spirits and stuff like that and principalities and powers, which are a lot of the, the spirits in high places, okay? So, again, don't fear. That's don't, don't fear. Um, source wanted somebody to know to alleviate that, okay? Um, and have hope. Okay, at all times when you start feeling fearful or nervous or anxious. Okay, that everything will balance itself out. Okay. Um, source wanted to also know, um, well, I mean, not know, Source wanted me to also tell somebody for those people who feel isolated or that like an outcast uh, to know that they belong and are needed in a very, very big way. I'm talking about the light workers, y'all. I'm talking about the 144. Sometimes we we are in this human body, okay? And I want y'all to know that we are flawed when we get here. And I guess and that's gonna come up. So it's got a message regarding that. But anyway, I just had to say that, okay? Because you know we're not perfect and we experience things. So I have a message for you guys, okay? Um, and again, when I come out here and talk. I'm going to say that, so it's want to remind me, and my hands ain't dirty, y'all. This is, I've been grounding, okay? I done had to put my whole, almost my whole arm, okay? All right? Under the, under the ground. That's all I can tell y'all. I done had to go down in there, okay? I mean, when I tell you they had me doing some things to throw some of that bullshit up off of me to clear some energies and stuff, and also to get prepared, sometimes sorts of, have you doing washings and cleansings and stuff like that um, and everything uh, to get you ready for your service, for your work, you know, to put on a certain type of uniform, okay? Because you may not be working in the same area and most of the time when you got different messages and different downloads and different people start coming in or going out, you understand? It changes things, it shifts stuff, okay? So we're constantly incarnating, okay? Okay, we're constantly incarnating, okay? But anyway, Source wants the light workers to know that y'all got a certain breed of soul, okay? So you got to be, you got to understand that, okay? Okay, Source wants y'all to know y'all was incarnated in the body that y'all have to enlighten and guide and teach, okay, when y'all are needed. Y'all are in a special uh, military, you understand? Y'all are an army of light, you understand? Y'all are an army of light workers, Okay, y'all have arrived on this planet basically to do uh, due to global issues that rapidly is spinning out of control. You understand that? Rapidly spinning out of control. You understand? Becoming a serious threat to humanity. And I'm talking about y'all. We are in a spiritual. Uh, this thing is spiritual, and I have. Some, I'm gonna go off into that again because recently I watched uh, ABC News, and uh, it was a guy on there. I wrote his name down. It's coming up, guys. Uh, Goya. So I said, just tell him Goya, okay? That needs to meditate. So so, so somebody will stay, stick with this, okay? Because it gets it gets a little bit, uh, I'm giving y'all the 101 of the message right now, but it's going to get a little bit more technical, okay? A little bit more spiritual, okay? In a minute, okay? So anybody that's here, waiting on the cards to be flipped or for me to confirm with the cards. No, I have a lot of confirmation right here and I want to use this first. All right. All right. Cause I have personal messages for people that I have to get out. I mean, source these, uh, uh, deceased family members literally, okay. Spoke said names. So I have to put, get that out. All right. Source so wants y'all guys to know that we are live we are living amongst okay a lot of collective uh, and a lot a lot of the collective which is the light workers a lot of us uh, we're living um, uh, the healers the teachers the watchers the seekers whatever the seers all of us we are uh, uh, living amongst others who are unaware who have the same gifts, who have similar gifts. We need to be mindful. Source wanted me to tell, uh, uh, to say that. We need to be mindful that there's people coming here, 
You understand? That don't need lateral violence. In other words, they don't need other readers and shit like that fucking with them. They don't need that. Again, y'all is y'all are interrupting, I'm getting sore to say, the cycle of this sequence. That's what I'm getting sore to say. Y'all fucking with the cycle of sequence when y'all don't accept or encourage. And I'm going to tell you why some of the light workers who are light workers, they still are bearing their name. Stripped of a lot of things though. And that's why y'all ain't, that's why a lot of shit going on. Okay. But so it's more, I got a message for y'all. Okay. All right. Like I said, I am new to putting my spirituality on TV. But at the age of 12 years old, I felt the Holy Spirit enter my belly, okay? Before any child I've ever had was born, I had I had the Holy Spirit, you understand? I had the renewal of, 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 of my flesh, you understand? I was renewed, you understand, at the age of 12 years old, okay? And before then... Okay, before the age of 12 years old, I was re I was delivering messages. I remember I gave my mother probably at the age of maybe three or four years old. But I might have been five. Sources saying you were five. Uh, a, a, a lottery number when she was coming down on some hard times. I think the source said it was a light bill. She was having a problem with a utility bill. She needed some money. You gave her a, a, a lottery. Uh, I think he's showing me the number was 132. Or, yeah, he showed me 132, so I'm going to take that, okay? I gave her a, 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 a number, and she hit that number, okay? So for some of y'all, maybe y'all, that's for somebody. Maybe somebody need a quick blessing. Somebody on down on hard times. But I gave her a number, and if Source said it was that number, I'm taking it. But I gave her that number, and she hit that lottery, okay? So it show, told me she hit that lottery, all right? Because we de I'm dealing with Source with a lot, Okay? Uh, to just hold me up right now where I'm going through a lot of things, you know, personal things in my life as far as my family is concerned and all that different type of stuff, the loss of my son, you know, uh, li living in a new state, just a lot of different changes, newly divorced after 20 years, just a lot, 21 years. So it's just been a lot, okay? And so that's just a little of wh where my journey Okay, that uh, of, of, of why my journey is what it is and why what God put together, he won't let nobody, you understand, tear it apart, throw it down, take it under or anything like that. You understand that? It is to who he that gives me, to, 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 as a member, that gives me the authority and gives me the uh uh, the wisdom of divine speech and i'm thankful for that you understand 37 33 on the clock i'm not playing with anybody and i'm not gonna throw stones i come in peace and y'all know what happens you understand to, to to many countries many lands many people all kinds of people you understand who when you tell them you come in peace you hear me and and they come with the snake and shit they want to they want to come with deciphering and all this type of shit you understand you know what happened to their foundation, okay? So, like I said, I don't have to rule out any motherfucking thing when it comes to something rotten and poisonous in my life. You understand? Because I'm covered, and I ain't going to say that too many times because I don't have to, okay? I tell a motherfucker to take action. You understand? Take flight because I'm always taking off. I take off every day that I wake up and get out that bed. I'm on takeoff mode, all right? That's right. I'm on takeoff mode. All right. I'm in my I'm in my spiritual fueled up jet plane. Okay. So so spirit, God, your team, your dreams, etc. Okay. Know that this earth needs y'all. Okay, collective 144. Okay, chosen few. And the earth needs y'all more in these times than ever before. You understand that? Okay. I was reading a book and it said by 2040 that the earth could reach about 9 billion people. I said, damn. And then um, I thought to myself, I said, well, you know, me being who I am. I said, well, damn, that's a beautiful earth, you know. That's how I am. That's what I said. Source want me to tell somebody who uh, is still thinking about me, my uh, my message of a 
about this planet. Okay, so it says somebody said uh, this planet fucked up or something like that. You know, they had it was a ne something negative. Source wanted me to tell somebody that person who said that. Okay, don't ask me how I know. Don't ask me, but just know. Source wants y'all to know it's not the people. It's not the planet. It's the people. Okay, it's not the planet. It's the vibration of people's minds. Okay, it's the shifts and a lot of things that individuals have done to the planet as well. But this planet is beautiful and Source want that person to pray for America. And that's what they said. Pray for America, whoever that was. You understand? Pray for America. Don't, 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 because uh, uh, this is somebody who's American. Okay, they was born here who said that. And Source wants y'all to know that y'all are instructed to pray for y'all planet. Y'all are instructed to pray for, pray for y'all country and for the country's leaders. 44, uh, 40, 49 on the clock. All right? Do that. That's very important. Because, see, this is the thing. That's the only way we can annihilate darkness. And that's what light workers does. Okay? All right? Because um, darkness is beginning to overtake the earth. And they talking about it everywhere. Okay? We are this this whole planet is experiencing this universe source said say is source said the universe. Okay, when I said planet, the universe. Let me fix that. The universe is experiencing so many shifts because of energetic fields. And that's the energy of people, the energy, the changes in global warming, the changes in the earth's atmosphere, the earth's crest. I'm getting all of that is happening. Okay, and it's changing different things. But it's waking up a lot, okay? 41, 44 on the clock. Humanity has become materialistic. So I said, this is the, I'm, I'm, I'm giving y'all the messages from the divine that I got. Humanity has become materialistic. They have become very power hungry and filled with greed. That the vices of mankind may be what, May, may be what will destroy, okay, uh, the earth along with us on it, okay? Okay, these things, these vices is causing us to destroy ourselves, okay? And Source is, is trying to give us a war warning because, like I said, this imbalance, this is how it all, this, if you go back when it was new, you understand? This is this is repeat. It, it, it things is repeating itself. You understand? Abominations and stuff like that. The carrying on of all of these things that's just like most of it stems from envy, from jealousy. You understand? This is this is it's a shocker. All the message I got. You know, I I, I read a lot. I really do. I read a lot. When I tell y'all. I can't have certain things around me and not pick it up and read it. You know what I'm saying? I can't. I just can't do it. I can't know that I can. That it's a possibility for things that I think in my mind. It's a possibility I can get deeper or dive deeper into it because of all the uh, social media platforms, because of all of the uh, just Google period, just the internet, just so you know, just uh, the web, you know to find information all of the online and ebook stores it's always a way you understand for a seeker to seek things and then find okay so that's that's for somebody else too as well keep that in mind but anyway um let me keep going um their source want us to know that there still is a reason for hope okay okay and so it's wanted somebody to know. 44.07 on the clock. The only thing that darkness fear is light, y'all. Okay? Now we at 10, I'll say 7. We did the 101 of it, of the message. Now we at 107 of the message. Because now we finna pretty much go there. Okay? And that is, this right here is the highlight. Okay? Of this message because 
this whole planet, everybody on it, you understand, needs hope right now. We all need hope right now. Like that is pretty much the thick layer, okay, of what's holding everything together right now. You understand is that everybody is hollering. We just got to hope for the better. I mean, the eat the real is hearing that, is receiving that, y'all, okay? Because that hope is allowing us second chances. That hope is allowing us to get it right. That hope is allowing us to um, finish cycles, complete cycles, end cycles, start cycles. You understand? That hope is what's doing that, y'all. But the one thing that we got to do now is focus on annihilating the darkness. You understand? We don't want that. Okay? The ether real do not want that. The earth is angry. The universe is angry. 45, 46 on the clock is angry, y'all. About all, it's too much. It's too much. It's causing a lot of shifts and things. And I have a book also that Source gave me for myself to get. Um, and, um, and, it, and I put the book, I was able to uh, figure out what this book was. Um, it, it took a lot, but I got it. Okay, I got it. And then I looked up what this book was that Source wanted me to get. And when I saw what the book was, when I Googled it and I found it after, you know, Source was moving my fingers and giving me ideas and, you know, all of that for me to come on with it, right? Uh, for them to give it to me, um, for me to give it to y'all, okay? Again, I'm sharing, okay? Again, I come in peace. Take what resonates, leave the rest, all right? But anyway, darkness fear is one thing, y'all, and that's light. And let me tell you why. Not all the stuff I just said, okay? Okay, darkness fear is light because of hope, okay? That's 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 one of the biggest uh uh, uh, technical TKOs that can fuck up some darkness, okay? Somebody refusing to accept the intention of that negative thing, those negative people or anything else. But also, Source wanted y'all to know because it simply cannot survive in it. You understand that? Darkness can't survive in light. You understand? It cannot because you become a torchbearer. That's what happens. You become a fucking torch bearer when they throw that shit on your ass. And that's what I did today. I lit a torch on them motherfuckers. The motherfuckers that sent that shit to me or that came with that dumb shit or that's fucking with my kids, causing all this bullshit, you understand, to tr try to stop me or anything. You understand that? I know what the fuck they doing. I know what's going on. You understand? I'm all, I'm fighting. I'm fighting, y'all. You hear me? I'm fighting. I'm fighting too. And I know, you understand, that I got spiritual rank, but I'm fighting. You understand? I'm fighting to trust, to have hope in God that a way will be made. I'm fighting to trust in my ancestors, my spiritual team, and my guides. You understand? Trust in what I got on the inside, what I know I got on the inside to help bring me out of a situation. You understand that I need to be lighter. Or that I need to uh, uh, be vindicated. Or that I need to be stopped. Okay? But understand, as a torchbearer, you have the power to neutralize some motherfucking darkness. You understand that? You have some power. Okay? 11.59 on the clock. All right? You got some power. Source wants y'all light workers to know that y'all got to undergo these life experiences, okay? Because those experiences is going to give, going to provide y'all with empathic understanding, okay, of others. And that's a key point. Y'all going to be tested. Y'all going to be tempted. Y'all going to be pushed. Y'all going to be shoved. Y'all going to be bullied. Y'all going to be gang stalked. Y'all going to be... Uh, all of that broken hearted you understand y'all gonna go y'all gonna have a little bit of money y'all gonna have a lot of money sometime it's gonna be a lot of different things that we go through you understand you understand and we can sometimes feel like we got unhappy lives you know some of y'all feel like y'all ain't got 
Y'all ain't turned up, okay? But Source wants some of y'all to turn that motherfucking uh, social media off too. You understand? Where motherfuckers on there acting like they ain't got problems, okay? Where your cousins and your aunts and your uncles and your sisters and your brothers and your old classmates, college students, fraternity, goddamn folks and all that shit. Okay, where they acting like they guys get to the motherfucking world and they ain't got nothing going on. Okay, but y'all minds is being lured into those illusions, the matrix. And that's another thing that we're going to get off into. Now, notice how the, the energy then rolls. I hope everybody understand that. All right, notice how that energy then rolls, y'all. Okay, and it rolls. Uh, and I'm going to let it rise. I'm going to light me something. Okay, so uh, clear some of it. Get it back in balance. All right, because we don't need that shit. All right, we do not need that. All right, that's what I want somebody to know. We don't need that uh, old chaos going on. All right. That's what I want some of y'all to know. Oh, sorry, excuse me, guys. Oh, I got my pajamas on. And, uh, oh, sitting around these old tad legs, child. Sitting around, uh, in my thing, in my spirit. Yep. Relaxed. I did have a glass of wine today. I did do that. I did that as a part of my cleansing of my blood. Yep, as a part of my cleansing of my blood. I sure do. That made me want to pour a little bit more. Mm-hmm. Cheers, everybody. And y'all welcome to go get a glass of wine, water, light up, whatever you want to do, okay? Don't matter to me. You welcome to do whatever you're doing. You at home, hopefully comfortable, wherever you are, Okay. And if you're not at home, you out still taking care of things or whatever at this time of night. I want y'all, because where I'm at is a little bit, a few minutes past midnight. And uh, I want y'all to be safe, okay? That's what I want y'all to do. I want everybody to be safe, all right? All right. Okay, just felt that a little bit there. That didn't, that didn't feel too hot. Oh, I didn't like that. That was, it was coming. Mm-hmm. Ooh. I didn't want to get in that camera, but I got my scarf on and all that. Oh, I'm in my bonnet. All right. So anyway, guys, let me get back to the message, okay? Because that's what this about. This ain't about nothing else but that message, okay? Because it's very important that you guys uh get it, okay? It's real important that y'all get it. Okay, so... I don't want to get in that camera. So, uh, anyway, so we can feel like we, as, you know, light workers, we can feel, uh, healers, whatever you, 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 you're, you're, uh, you're prooting in, wherever your prooting is at, wherever your, wherever your gifts are, you understand, the strengths of them, you understand, as a collective, okay, as a 144 chosen one. You, you you can feel a certain type of way, y'all. It's all right, okay? I want y'all to know that it's okay. It's okay to feel it. All right? I want y'all to know that. It's really okay. But at the same time, you know, I, Source don't want that to change, y'all. You know? Source don't want that to make y'all light workers feel overwhelmed. You understand what I'm saying? Where y'all don't want to cast y'all light into the world because of the things y'all going through. Is you know what I'm saying? Don't 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 start uh, uh, feeling condemned. Don't start feeling isolated. Don't start feeling you know blocked. That's what I'm getting. Source say a lot of it's some light workers out here feel feel blocked. You understand? No. Understand what you have, that you're undergoing some experiences. Some of y'all is empathic understandings that y'all have to get. It's some things y'all got to do. That's why I said we shifting. It's a lot of different frequencies going on. 
Okay, Source talked to me about a whole lot of stuff. I mean, when I tell you, Source was uh speaking to me about just just uh the uh imperativeness, you know, of understanding what the universe is going through right now. We going through some things, y'all, okay? And it, it and it's serious. You understand? I mean, I mean, we're going to get off into Melchizedek. Uh, we're going to get off into, because I was getting that. Look, as soon as I said that, the birds start going off. Then we're going to uh, get off into um, uh, the Schumann residence, okay, uh, that's going on. And this is, that is the main uh, thing that's happening right now, okay, Um we under a different mystic order. The universe is under mystic order right now. That's what I'm getting source say. It's under mystic order. Okay? The planet is getting a new brain. Okay? And so this is what's happening. Okay? Our ancestors are redesigning the brain of this planet and is doing it for a sec uh, for a different type of awakening that's going to happen. In other words, uh source is saying a new Jerusalem right here. Okay? All right, so I want y'all to understand that it's a lot going on. This planet got to do some things, okay? Okay, so y'all need to stay in y'all Saphir and y'all Hatsu. Y'all need to stay in y'all Altajashur. Y'all need to stay in y'all Sakamitre, okay? So I hope y'all understood all of that. In, in other words, the ability to see, stay intuitive, keep your third eye and your chakras balanced, okay? It's very, very important right now. At, at, if no other time in y'all lives, okay, it is it is so important, okay. Okay, that's the ability to communicate, okay, okay. That's your telepathy and your intuition, your hatsu, okay. So keep keep that in mind, all right. So like I said, we y'all have to. You gotta, you gotta, you got, it's different instructions being given sometimes. Sometimes it ain't in the books. Cause let me tell you what happened. I ran to my books to get that energy off of me after posting that video of my, of me, my live face on there. It was all kind of things going on. And the first thing I did was ran to my books. The, you know, to rule out evil. You understand? Uh, 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 spiritual protection. You know, I went. You know what I'm saying? Because, oh, I got some shit that I can read. I got some motherfucking um, uh, magical words, the motherfuckers that I can say. I can sing them too. You understand? But it wasn't even about that. You understand? I can reverse some spells. It wasn't about that. What it was was, Source said, what we need right now, it ain't, it ain't in the books. A lot of it ain't in the books, okay? It's that thinking. It's your mind. It's, it's, it's reprogramming your central nervous system, your autonomic nervous system. You know, what you put in your body, what time you go to bed, acknowledging the uh, synchronicities of numbers. It's just so, right now, y'all, we are in not just technical world because of, you know, cell phones and all that shit. Uh-uh. Oh, no. We are in a technical world of change as well. Our universe is tech, tech. It's very. It, it's becoming uh, more. I'm hearing source say it's it's way. It's further than tech. Okay, we're entering. We're going back into those into those. Uh, um, uh, you know, them laser days. That's what I'm getting source say. I just seen a big, a big laser ray. Yeah, them laser days. Okay, now I see somebody smiling at me so i must have got it okay so as a light worker you will feel very overwhelmed okay but source wants y'all to keep casting y'all light in the world source want uh y'all to know that the world y'all <laughs> and i'm taking this a little bit away from my notes okay because this is very important the world is cloaked y'all in darkness it's polluted with negativity I'm going to say that again. The world, y'all, is cloaked in darkness. And it is polluted with negativity. Do you understand that? Y'all have had many, as light workers, as y'all have had many 
uh, near-death experiences. I know y'all have, okay? We wouldn't, you can't be chosen, okay? If you haven't went through some near-death fucking experiences, okay? I'm talking about, I ain't talking about almost getting hit by a car and you ran, you know, and jumped over and it didn't get you or you, your brakes went out and, and you, you know, you slid in the snow and it was just by the skin of your teeth that you, you know, the old something stopped the car and it went to the left. No, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about when you have been severely spiritually attacked, okay? Where because of those uh, attacks, okay, that spell work that was thrown at you. Now, some of y'all could have been had them physical near-death experiences. You know, somebody tried to shoot you. Sources saying that's that that that's a part of that y'all that 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 uh that that caused ascensions for many of y'all. Okay, those physical near-death experiences. But I'm talking about the ones where all y'all life people ain't did nothing but tried to throw spell work on y'all motherfucking ass and energy harvest from you guys because from a child they saw something inside of you and knew who you were. You understand? And that's what they purpose was the whole time. These people, motherfuckers, y'all done been born of some people and, and it's from, and they was, they was enemies in past lives. You understand? Some of y'all mothers, you understand what motherfuckers that y'all had to come back through. I hate to call, I ain't calling nobody mother motherfucker, okay? But I'm just saying, that's, that's just, that's just what I just got, okay? I just got that, that just channeled out, all right? I'm just letting y'all know. Because I don't think my mother is a motherfucker. Sometimes I think she is so many other things, but not a motherfucker. Okay? So I will say that. But I'm going to tell y'all like this. Okay? All right, now. We're going to get off into it. Because some of y'all chose to come on and fight this fight. Some of y'all chose to come on. You understand? Instead of being them stars that'll just stay on up there. Okay? And watch from the cosmos. Okay? Guide from the cosmos. That's what I'm getting, so I say. So, again, you know, y'all done had these experiences. Okay? But y'all also know who brought y'all out. Y'all know who brought y'all out of that shit. Y'all know who cleansed it, who gave y'all special instructions on how to get rid of things that y'all didn't even know what to do or how it was going to end. Okay? So it's not uncommon for people who are not aware of their gifts, okay, who they are, uh, you know, who 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 are uh, uh, unaware that they are uh, star seeds, they are gems, they are chosen, they do have a mission, cause we all do. Everybody is not, nobody's here for nothing. You understand that? Everybody got a reason. Some people just again, they not channeling theirs, okay? So they're living. A certain type of life that's not really their identity. Okay, so that's why we can have sleepwalkers. That's why we can have motherfuckers who is pretty much, you know, zombies. We that 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 exists. People that's running around that don't know who the fuck they is, or if they do know who they are, they just not acting in their god body of that of who they are. They choosing the other shit. Okay, they choosing that other shit to deal with. Okay. Um, so just know that those people though who come to, now I'm getting to 110. We finna, we finna, we finna, we finna, we are uh, an hour and three minutes. And that's good for what's left. Okay. Now I'm in 110 of this. Okay. Okay. This ain't this ain't this ain't spirituality 101. We way past that. Again, like I said, when I come out most of the time i'm telling you even though a lot of my earlier videos i see i see what's going on it's me recognizing the power okay not only that i have okay because i'm gonna recognize that first even when i'm stuttering or whatever they doing because that's really letting me know okay when that when when my body start trying to fight uh when my flesh start trying to fight my spirit and source told me, don't give motherfuckers no power that they doing shit. I'm I'm not allowed to say that somebody messing with this and messing with that anymore, especially not on live TV. Because again, I take my shit to the divine, and I let the divine deal with it. I let my ancestors and guides deal with people that throw shit at me. 
I don't have to do a motherfucking thing. My rank does all that. I don't got to do it. You understand? I'm letting that speak for itself. And that's it. I'm going to let that deal with it. And that's that. Because it's dealt with everything fucking thing else. So again, you know, hey, it is what it is. So, but now Source wants y'all to, you know, stay with me on this. Because this is this part. What y'all don't understand or need, some people is not understanding. Because right now, it's a lot of light workers. You understand? Who have, you know, they, they, they didn't felt they didn't felt all of that unhappiness. They didn't felt, you know what I'm saying, being tested, pushed. You know, that's where I was getting when I kept getting, you know, I know y'all tired. So I just kept getting that message. Tell them, hold on. Tell them, don't give up. Tell them, I mean, since I've been on here, you know what I'm saying, St you know, stand your ground. Don't, you know, th it's this, this after all of them videos, this message right here. It's, it's, it, that's why I said stuff be timeless and then shit have you, you might get a little bit from, from a reading or a messenger or whatever you want to call them, tarot reader. I don't know. Cause I'm a messenger, but you may get all of that from, and a teacher. That's what source said. You a teacher. Okay. And a messenger. You understand? Under, or under the order of a light worker, a 144, you know what I'm saying? A light being a healer. I'm all of that. But Source wants y'all to know, because of these things, feeling like this, it's, you know what I'm saying, feeling tested, feeling like, you know, you being pushed and stuff like that, you know, having those traumatic experiences that some of us have had in our lives, you understand what I'm saying, you know, it's not going to annihilate our duties. It's not going to, it's not going to excuse, give you an excuse, you understand, to run off and, and do what they doing or to, you know, get into such a low vibrational state, you understand, where you stop casting your light. In other words, you stop working. You quit your job for the divine. You can't, You quit your job for the divine. You don't have to flip cards or you don't have to share your spirituality with nobody. You can walk away from that any time. But you do have to let your light shine. You understand? Because, again, if you're a light worker, somebody see that. You know what the light do. It attracts not only darkness. We got to change that, 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 that narrative, okay? It's an annihilation happening because what's happening is it's changing the format and the chemistry, chemistry and the sequence of this planet and, and our ability to have uh, an awareness of what we are up against, what's going to happen to the place we dwell right now as live beings. Okay, as humans. So, Source wants y'all to know, keep casting your light. Okay, because people are coming to these platforms looking, you understand, for spiritual nourishment. They looking for some guidance. They looking for those things, okay? They don't want, Source don't want us to fall into no deep state of sadness. You understand, because they always trying to beat us. You understand that? But Source don't want us to fall into no deep state of sadness because, again, we'll be fulfilling their divine purpose for us to suffer. You understand that? And we're not, that's not what we, that's not what Source wants y'all to know, light workers. That's not what Source got in y'all now, y'all future, you understand? And even, I'm, I'm getting Source say, and even further. Okay? Um, <clears throat> Let me drink a little bit of water. Uh, okay, so also, um, um, you got you got a lot of psychosomatic people that come here. You understand? With psychosomatic illnesses, okay, who are very antisocial people as well. You understand? The, and and that's and a lot of those that's that's again those are traits, you understand? Especially the uh, the antisocial behavior, you know. Light workers, I know, I know you be set aside. You know, what I'm saying the divine will exile you. You wondering why? I never wonder why I wasn't accepted. 
I always wondered why they did me like, you know, my family never really invited me to shit. They, you know, I was the outcast, the black sheep. That's who I am. You understand? It's a whole lot of us. You understand? On my uh, 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 mother's father's side of the family. And, uh, and that's the side I really was raised around mostly. And um, it's a lot of us. And I just think about, you know, how, you know, just because you go away to go to college or, or you go away to, uh, to get, in, you know, to, you know, to move somewhere, you know, from re really your childhood, uh, uh, home or whatever, doesn't mean that you change yourself. You cloak yourself into somebody else because you're not the same person when you come back or come around them individuals to the point where, Motherfuckers feel inadequate, you know, and they're distant, standoffish. They click up, you know, and uh, because you was the last little cub to get inside that den, you understand what I'm saying? You don't get an equal share of the meat or the hunt, you understand, from that pride. But uh, light workers, source wants y'all to know, you understand, that y'all are very special you understand and that y'all have jobs to do and not worry about the jobs of that them people uh don't want you to have or say you don't deserve or try to give you that's what i'm getting so I say that's not uh it's not fitting of you it doesn't fit you it doesn't resonate with you it's not what you're on okay well source wants y'all to know why y'all having that hope you understand and sharing that light to keep in mind that we have people that come and sit with us who are tearing okay remember that I know this is some of y'all's, uh, uh, this is y'all full-time job or whatever the situation is. And I do it like this because it's a, I, I, I said, I know, and I don't know nothing about y'all people. Okay. I don't know nothing about y'all people. I don't have an audience of anybody of any, if it was been six people that looked at a video of mine, I have never did a message in front of six people face to face. Okay. So I want y'all to know that's what I mean by that. Y'all, this is a process, okay? And we got people who come here who has addictive behaviors and, uh, and everything because they have been led and they seeking, okay? Trying to find out information, including who they are. And we as the 144 up here providing platforms and channels and things like that, podcasts and all that for individuals to come into our world, you understand, and share our ideas with them, we have to keep in mind that some of these people are vibing on a very low vibration. So we must, in turn, understand that we got cross watchers who are murderers and shit like that. You can't be on there talking about certain shit, okay, when you led not to do it, but you're going to stay on there longer. Now, this ain't, let it resonate where it do. So if people feeling like this or a certain type of way, maybe that's why I had to do all the shit I had to do. You understand? Once I put my motherfucking face on there, all right, to get that shit up off of me. But I'm unstoppable. You understand that? And I know that. And I'm unstoppable because I know who rad with me. You understand? I know who rocks with me. So I'm not going to worry about that. And I ain't going to keep telling the motherfucker, y'all, the so-called spiritualists that's out there, the ones that's, uh, that they can, they can find out where everything is motherfucking figure outable, go check and see what they tell you. That's all I can tell you. See how far you get. That's all I can say. So, again, I know you did some crazy shit. And you see, I put my motherfucking feathers on, right? All right. That's all I got to tell you. And I got a whole lot of them. All right? Just know that. <clears throat> I done told them already about that motherfucking be new bird. I ain't going to keep telling them, source. I ain't got to repeat that again. Okay, because I know what you're saying about it to me right now, but they don't need to know that. I know they don't need to know that because they didn't heard it already. 
But anyway, I want to go back to the message because that energy is not what I'm trying to get, but it'll get in there, you know, on us. But in the process, uh, these people who come, they become addicted to finding out different things. And sources is, is, is very concerned about some of the uh, uh, the readers and everything, the messengers or whatever you call yourself. Because I know we all got personal names, you know, different names uh, and stuff like that. Handles, sources saying. We got handles, you know. But uh, whatever you are, and, you know, keep in mind that we're dealing with very low vibrational people with low frequencies. And we have to be very delicate. And we have to be very, uh, we have to be careful, okay, uh, about what we saying uh, and stuff and what we provide, giving out of there. We don't want to get anybody hurt as well, okay, because we, we, we need another 20 minutes or 30 minutes on there for another motherfucking cash app or a PayPal deposit, some donation, okay? No, we're not going to do that. We're going to stay in this motherfucking uh, 6 and 7D, and we're going to, uh, allow the 3D matrix vibrational individuals, we're going to let them get caught. See, because they don't want to get caught on no motherfucking platform. They don't want to get caught out here, okay? They don't want them goddamn alligators and the motherfucking, all that other shit. They don't want to reap that karma playing no games, okay? Especially uh, talking about this is the divine and all that kind of stuff. No, lose your egos, okay? And that's what Source is saying, okay? Keep in mind, who might be out there you talking to, okay? That's what they saying. Keep in mind. Be very careful, all right? Okay? Source don't want y'all to abandon y'all duties for no money. You understand what I'm saying? They don't want y'all to do that. Don't divine, don't uh, uh, abandon y'all duties, okay? Because y'all been given divine gifts, okay? And y'all have an obligation to use them to, enhan to enhance the greater good of mankind, okay, that's what y'all, that's the oath, that's what y'all doing, I hope, that's what motherfuckers is doing, okay, because this is the thing, you will bring somebody, the people that's not, you understand that they want to do this and help people with this and all of that, y'all don't know them people's situation, motherfuckers come every day and tell y'all read every day and say how somebody told somebody a motherfucking lie to get somebody that was dark to work with them against you. So motherfuckers can lie on people, okay? But it's some people, sources, very concerned about who is taking the bribe, okay? That's what that bribe, y'all getting bribe cards and all that shit, that's what that motherfucking bribe is, card is about, okay? It's about motherfuckers taking bribes, okay? And people need to stop because they selling their souls and they having, they're, they're revoking, I'm getting source say, I'm revoking motherfuckers' license, I'm doing a clean out. This shit is real. That's what I'm getting. I'm that, that's what I'm channeling. I swear. I'm I'm gonna revoke motherfucker shit. <clears throat> okay? So something must have happened in the ether real for all of this to be like front and center. Okay? Especially for me. Okay? Understand that because y'all light workers and y'all got divine gifts, okay, that y'all are being being given by high ranked. Okay, officials, okay, in the ether real, all right, to do, okay, to, 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 to help people on their journey towards internal, eternal bliss, all right, to help them navigate through the duet, you understand, to help them uh, maintain their netaru abilities, to keep y'all and y'all God goddesses, and that's what the lowercase g, okay, and y'all natural spirits, okay, y'all got to understand that, okay, because so source I heard source say I will I will take I will make I will I will take I'm taking some of the highest pharaohs right now, and I'm 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 dwindling them down to the lowest of servants, okay. And that's because they stayed on this motherfucking TV a little bit too long, all right? 119 on the clock, all right? And, 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 he, and, and, and source, I, I heard Source say, there's, there's a bridge, a 
okay between the supernatural world okay uh, uh, uh the netaru and the mortal world of the remnant okay and this represents our spiritual aspect of of, of of the four base elements that men and women interact with on a daily basis so we need to we need to definitely we need to understand position when we out here okay and not abandon our duties basically don't do that All right. We trying to get to the land of the reeds, y'all. That's what we trying to do. We trying to get to the land of the motherfucking reeds. Okay? Where our souls can live in happiness for eternity. So we don't want to do anything against the feather of my yacht. Not right now. Understand that. Because everybody going to have a final judgment. Whether their eyes is open or closed. That's what I'm hearing Source say. They got a final fucking judgment. Okay, so if it's light workers out here who's willing to risk their abilities, who's willing to risk their gifts for the bullshit and return to nothingness, okay, in the jaws of all these amits out here and these motherfucking soul eaters, go right on ahead. Y'all keep on doing what y'all doing. I hope y'all click like and Get click, like, and shares, okay, for the rest of eternity. Okay, that's what I hope y'all get. Because I'm not looking for that, okay? I'm not looking for that. So if a motherfucker coming over here, fucking with me about a like, a share, a goddamn subscribe, take the motherfuckers. I'm still going to have what's inside of me. And I'm still going to be doing what the fuck I'm doing. And Source going to still be blessing me. And my team going to still rad with me. You understand? And rad for me. Okay, so y'all better understand something. That the road trying to get the road trying to get back to light, once you done got off that path, is a motherfucker, y'all. Okay? Cause I went to try to conform. And I'm telling my my listeners, those that have an ear, let them hear. That's what I'm hearing. So I say, let them hear what thus uh says the Lord. Okay? Believe my prophets, so shall ye prosper. And that's what I'm telling y'all. That road, uh, whoo, I'm feeling it. Just here it come. That road, y'all. Come on, Holy Spirit. That road, help me, cause I don't. I'm trying to get. I'm trying not to start screaming and hollering at my native right now, cause I'm telling y'all, I got them. They tricked me to get away from my shit. You understand? These motherfuckers that want to take you down, want to cause you to uh, lose your place in line, as my son just said. I just heard him say, you want to lose your motherfucking place in line? Well, go head on and do some of that other shit, okay? Because at the end of the day, you're going to have a long motherfucking and painful motherfucking road to get back to that light. And that's for some of y'all, okay? So y'all better give some of this some some space to some of this shit. Everybody that email y'all, I'm hearing source say, everybody the council is saying it. They said we talking to you from the council. Everybody who email y'all, I'm talking to the 144. Everybody that email y'all, everybody that asks y'all for a reading, y'all cannot do it. And I mean that. Y'all cannot. Some of y'all have given motherfuckers loaded goddamn 357 motherfucking magnums and sawed off shotguns to come after the God's collective. So Source wants y'all to learn what y'all need to know so that y'all can continue to work on this earth, here on this earth. You understand that? And that's for somebody. Some of y'all still growing spiritually, okay, in this process. We all, source says, have prerequisites. We all have to go back for continued education when it comes to this spirit thing, okay? 
Y'all got to keep speaking to the collective, the true light workers. Okay? Who are not forgetting the message. You understand that? For click, like, and shares and shit. Subscribes. And I ain't shading on nobody. I'm just saying. Okay? Something going on in the ether realm. That's what I'm trying to tell y'all. And Source don't like it. Source is saying don't allow y'all gifts. Okay? Y'all mission to be labeled as psychic powers. You understand that? But to be grounded in y'all work that is healing somebody, that is helping somebody, that is providing hope to somebody and divine purpose and protection. You understand? Y'all got various sensory, uh, uh, extra sensory perce uh, 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 perceptions. Including seeing and communicating with the deceased. You understand? Y'all got to keep in mind and stay, stay in that mind. Because our karma is way worse than other people's. We feel it. I'm talking about we feel it. We like that crying angel, okay? That just, I mean, oh my, it's, it's coming out so hard. It's coming out so fast. I, them angels be like, Archangel Michael and, and, and Rock, they just have a bucket. Like, just go on, let them go on, on in there. Put them on in there, okay? Because they special. They also know y'all going to get right. When y'all go through tower moments and shit like that and go get in that to that low vibrational state for motherfuckers. You know? Sometimes we mess up and get tricked, get Johnny Mac, get snick, get snaked like it ain't nothing. You understand me? Because we have empath uh personalities, characteristics, hearts. You understand? We are put here to enlighten others, y'all. In their spiritual paths. I'm going to say that again. We are put here to enlighten others. In their spiritual paths. And I don't want y'all to forget that. Okay. Not just to tell the future. You understand that? Because that ain't what it's about. Like I said. Some things is timeless. So you're going to get one part. You may go to your favorite reader. On a Monday. You don't understand. You got a piece. They got you pumped. They got you, you know, you got some armor. You got a little, you got, you, you added a little, you put your scepter in that fire. Okay. You ready. But then you don't get, you don't quite got it all. You don't understand certain things. So guess what's got to happen? You have to wait because she may not get a download or he may not get a download or they may not get a download to complete that situation to next week. Stay tuned. That's all I can tell people. But again, y'all ain't here to tell the future, to just do that. Y'all got to remember, this is a call and not a sideshow, all right? That's the first thing. You know what I'm saying? I be seeing people just like fixing themselves and they all in the mirror and this and that and all this different kind of shit and everything in the camera. And I be like, Lord have mercy, don't this person know I could feel them? This person need to, well, what they saying, they need to have on some goddamn sunglasses right now and goddamn gloves up to here, up to their goddamn neck. Because motherfuckers throwing. They kicking the, I'm talking about they in their power. And, and no, we ain't going to walk in fear. We ain't, like I said, source said, don't give them no power. Stop saying. They fucking with your chakras and all that kind of stuff. As well, source said, uh-uh, no, that ain't what that, that ain't what you're gonna do. You ain't gonna get them no power. What you're gonna understand is it's a different type of frequency going on. The energy is neck that negative energy field is is high. And what you're gonna do is sit down because you need, since you don't know what to automatically do, then you need to sit down so we can give you instruction. Because it may be as simple, like I said, on an on uh, uh, is, is take a bath. I said that on a lot of free previous uh, videos. Take a bath. Take a shower. You understand? Sometimes it ain't nothing. Go to bed. Drink some water. And that be enough. But then you have every people that's on here every day and everything. And they've been guided. They supposed to. This battle is not ours. It's the Lord's. But it ain't never ending. 
It's never ending. We're always going to fight against flesh and blood as long as we, and principalities and powers and high places as long as we're here on this motherfucking planet. That's what's going to happen. You understand? People are going to be people who are built to steal, kill, and destroy. You understand that? But what we got to do is to see the difference between a psychic, a light worker. You understand what I'm saying? We got to understand what all that is. You understand? Because a light worker and a psychic is two different things. There's a difference. A psychic may tell you your future, while a light worker, what, what a light worker going to do, what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to guide you into your future. That's what I'm going to try to do. Okay? So that's the difference for me. Everybody got their own idea of things. I got a lot of what that's around in that light that I that I feel, okay, when I'm questioned about it or anything like that. But I bet you one thing, I'm not going to attempt to tell you, be God and tell you what you got going on. Because you're going to have choices along the way with each and everything. But what I will do is I'll tell you what I see. You understand? I'll, I'll collect information. You understand? From my guides, using my spiritual gifts, and I'll try to deliver you the most effective, you understand? The most quality information and factual truth information that I can without any without any confusion. Because that's not what I'm here for. I'm here to, 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 to break them motherfucking strongholds if I can by providing y'all with not only encouragement or some knowledge, you understand? Some free motherfucking knowledge, some, 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 uh, you know, some science. I'm getting sore to say some science. Okay? So, understand that y'all have to continue to embrace uh, uh, y'all divinity uh, on a constant. Okay? Y'all on a constant because it's it's, it's, it's it's a lot of people trying to awaken. Okay? They're trying to wake up their dormant light worker souls. And, and and uh they a lot of them not alone because we there as well. And everything that come with us, we there. Okay? I want y'all to know that. Mm, let me pull this out the way that smoke. Seems like it's full of thing. Okay. So again, um y'all don't want the messages to y'all families and stuff like that and friends and loved ones and everything that follow y'all from other social platforms. Y'all don't want their blood on y'all hand. That's what y'all don't want to do. So yes, y'all want to deliver y'all messages and y'all downloads. But at the same time, y'all also don't want to reap in the future. Okay? Having planted a seed. Okay? That's destructive. That's destroying. That's, I mean, just, it's deteriorating of other souls. Okay? And very irreversible. Okay, y'all do not want to plant no irreversible damage to anybody. Okay, we got enough religious folks out here doing that shit. All right, we don't want to be a part of that. That's why we are a collective. We are a chosen few and we are here for so many other reasons. But the one reason we all should agree on is that, you know what, karmic cycles, it don't, they don't always have to be bad things. You know, they don't have to always be real terrible things. But what we do want people to know is you want to treat people how you want to be treated. But at the same time, you want to constantly grow. You know what I'm saying? Grow in your knowledge and wisdom of this planet. You understand? And, it, and, it, and everything so that we could really be valuable to it. Okay? We can stay valuable to it. Okay? I just want my family and any viewers that I have, I want y'all to know that, you know, my cries and y'all cries, you understand? I'm going to give it where I got to give it, take it where I got to take it because I do not want, you know, any of those cries, any of those situations, any of those dangers. I don't want them to fall upon deaf ears. I want what I'm asking to help me help y'all. You understand? I want that to respond. You understand that? I want it to show up and arrive. You know what I'm saying? I want to hear about blessings. I want to hear thank yous. I want to hear, you know, I'm all right. You know what I'm saying? I'm safe. That's what I'm looking for. Because I know that my main thing that I have for people that in all things, 
You know, I don't, I don't know sometimes what, what, what's going to come out here. You understand? Because again, I channel shit and different things is intuitively instructed. Okay. So I, you know, and I can't explain it, but I can tell you it's from a very soft, sweet, you understand? But definitely a warrior. Okay. They don't play. Okay. I'm talking about tiger spit, uh, 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 energy. Okay. Okay, I want y'all to know that whatever y'all going through, it should pass. Okay, then all things present, that certain shit is going to pass. Trouble don't last always, y'all. And that y'all got help. You understand? Y'all got help. And as far as I'm concerned, y'all help is, has arrived as far as I'm concerned. Okay, because I'm going to do my very best to... Um, educate y'all and help y'all in some things you know i ain't doing questions and answers i'm not doing any of those things like that right now i'm not doing any private readings i don't have social media to really even advertise uh my channel because i'm working on some other things but this is the start of it you understand this is the start of it going within doing healing because as y'all heal the light workers are supposed to heal as well you understand? And not off of y'all energy. It's from releasing all of those. It's from releasing y'all in the energy of the, that negativity. That's how we heal. We heal and we stay uh, fired up and flamed up and ready for any battle. Not just for ourselves, but for y'all too. You understand? By uh, helping y'all say that this right here is no longer. You understand? Thank you. I knew this or I, knew, you know, just confirm. We confirmation. We confirmation just like the cards. We confirmation just like a sermon you go into the church uh, for and you like, I know I needed to go. Oh, I know I needed to go this Sunday. You know what I'm saying? Because it helped you. You understand? That's it. Everything ain't going to be motherfucking sugar coated. Not here. I'm not that type of person. I got a baby. I got, I, I, I wear some lashes and a little bit of lipstick and makeup and all that kind of shit every now and then. All right. And definitely when I leave out this motherfucking house. But what I will tell you is this. I'm not a pushover, especially not in the spirit. You understand me? I'm a motherfucking, uh, woo. And that, don't mess with me with that. Cause I get mad. And that's when, it, that's when, when I get, I notice when I, see, that's why I know that my mother's, you understand? Mama met. Okay, I know what happened. She told me what happened. She told me that they pissed her the fuck off. You understand? Just like I get mad like that. Just like Diggeroo. You know what I'm saying? Just like uh, uh, I be hearing how the anger and uh, peppermints uh, of some of her readings. And I be saying, oh, honey, not only do I be laughing sometimes, but I be like, she know how I feel. I know she do. That's what, okay, all right, okay, well, I ain't by myself because cause I get like that. I get like that. I'm telling you. I wear the pet, I, I wear her, I wear her candy motherfucker. Source told me she got a candy cane stripe. She, that's peppermint. You understand? She got, they got, they, she got men around her. You understand? They put men around her a lot of times. When she come out on the scene, she get they she get they sprinkle mint around that woman. Hey, peppermint. Source wants you to go get some, keep some peppermint, keep some mint leaves, not peppermint. You can use any anything mint, but they want you to get some mint. They want you to get some real mint. They want you to go to the grocery store and get some fresh mint. That's right. They don't want it cut up. They don't want none of that. They want to see it on there. You better put it on there. That's all I can tell you. Now you can go into why. That mint is in, why you got that name and why you put that up to that handle, I should say. Okay? Because Source is telling me uh, your name in the ether reel. Uh, okay? It's Ginger. That's your name in the ether reel. It's Ginger. Okay, Peppermint? Yeah, that part is Ginger. That's what they call you. They call you Ginger up there. Yeah, that part. And below. And in the underworld. Yeah, because you connected. You know that. You know you connected. You got access as above, so below, sweetheart. That's all I'm going to say. And yes, I'm here for the 144, the collective, okay? I'm a part of the motherfucking council. And I'm able to talk to y'all and call y'all names out. You understand? Again, like I said, I come in peace. Check my record. That's all. Source, one, source said, tell them to check your record. Anyway, again, 
fear, greed, ha and hatred. All of that shit, that's hundreds of years old. I ain't worried about it because I'm older in the spirit realm. And those that walk with me is ancient. So I ain't worried about all that shit. Ain't nobody going to throw none of that shit on me to, to change the narrative, to weaken me. No, I, I get sick like everybody else. I go through shit like everybody else, but I call my motherfucking power back like everybody else don't. You okay? That's what I do. The motherfuckers that throw it, okay, they going to get theirs back. Me, they throw it on me. I'm calling my power back. And I'm call, calling the powers that motherfucking be. That's right. You better believe it. And everybody else that they tell me to get. Nah. So, again, like I said, y'all don't want to tarnish y'all beautiful souls out there, collective. Y'all want to keep going. Y'all woke. You understand? The planet is woke. Okay? Okay? The planet is woke to what we doing to ourselves. You understand what we saying to others, what we saying to the ethereal, what we putting out in the universe. So we can't no longer, okay? We can no longer ignore our own part in the collective, okay? And that's what Source wants somebody to know. Y'all got to fix, some of y'all got to fix y'all motherfucking egos, okay? Because it ain't about all of that shit. Y'all don't even know. This is an algorithm. Y'all have no, no idea how much YouTube controls. Of any dollar y'all get, any motherfucking dime y'all get and everything else. Because y'all didn't see that by being blocked. You understand? They showing y'all who got the motherfucking power. So that's why I say to that person that said, should they go stand on the street and go read and go give messages? Hell yeah. That's right. YouTube can't shut that down. Can't fuck with that. Your bot, your little bowl you got. Your, 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 your uh, uh, a basket. That's what I'm hearing Source say. YouTube ain't gonna mess with your basket. Alright? Not that way. So yeah, you can, you can, you can, you can do that. You sure can. Shit. Ain't nothing wrong with giving a message. Okay? The church is you. You the church. That's what our source is saying. I'm hearing Source say. Your, your spirit, your cock hmm, is the church. Alright? So y'all want to command y'all egos, you understand? To not feed, not feed anybody discontentment, okay? Or any wars, okay? From y'all messages, okay? Or from, for, 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 from not the message, from y'all, you know, distorting the message. You understand? Because a lot of people is telling people shit for, for, for reasons. Okay, they feeling, they, see, you got some readers out here. If this was, oh, thank you, Holy Spirit. Come on now. Come on. Come on now. Come on, Maya. Come on, Maya. Come on. Y'all don't understand. It's some readers out here that was purpose, that was purposely placed in some of y'all feeds and to give certain messages. These motherfuckers know certain shit about us and everything else because they spiritualists as well. Okay, and they do a lot of magic and they'll tell motherfuckers anything to get them thrown off motherfucking course. You understand that? So Source wants y'all to know y'all better have y'all messages be the glory and the love of Source. Okay, that's our creator, y'all. Okay. Because Source don't want to have to send motherfuckers in spirit to spirit, put them in spiritual famines. That's what I heard Source say. I'm going to put these motherfuckers in spiritual famine if I have to. 143 on the clock and y'all know what come after 143. Like I said, don't, don't go into no spiritual famine and become a 143 instead of a 144. That's what I heard Source say. I'm making motherfuckers 143 and they going to work hard to get that motherfucking 1% back. Okay? So y'all better respect the utopia of God's favor. You understand that y'all have as human beings, because again, just because y'all the 144 don't mean that y'all is 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 excluded. You understand from having a destiny record that can be called in to the council. You understand, or that can get have a, a spiritual restraining order put on y'all from y'all tables. Some people didn't have a spiritual restraining order. That's what I'm getting so I say. Put on their ass from their tables. But they got back out there thinking that they was being stopped by somebody else, one of the collective. Somebody, they mama, they daddy, they ain't want them doing this or saying this. No. Sometimes you have to retreat. 
You understand? I said that sometimes you got to retreat. You got to sit, sit out. You understand? Because the frequencies that's being thrown at y'all, it's, it's, it, that's, it's causing a different type of sequence. You understand? It don't have to be that stuff is going on, your money acting funny or none of that. You, you know, It don't have to be you feeling sick or nauseated or drained. It don't have to be that. Sometimes, you understand me? It's just a, 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 a lack of fire. You understand? A lack of flame that you going to receive or the per or you understand? It's the audience. That's what I'm getting so I say. You understand? I, I it's one forty four on the clock. I have audiences for each and every individual. You got people that don't like comedy shows. You understand? So they don't go to comedy shows. You understand? You got motherfuckers that don't like uh dramas. So they don't go. They don't. They don't. When they get their remote control, that ain't what they looking for. They want action. Then you got motherfuckers who don't like action. They want drama. So they go to drama. So that's what y'all have to be keep remembering sources telling me to stay in y'all robes. That's where that was coming from yesterday. Stay in y'all robes. Y'all want to respect the utopia of God's favor over y'all life. You understand? Y'all don't want to get too lustful in things. We can't, we can't embody that shit. All right? We can't embody it. Even if we lonely, even if we, you know, whatever. We done worked seven days a week when we get out here. For the collective, we have to huh, take whatever spiritual baths you need, wash your face, brush your teeth, put your deodorant on, get on your gown, take your bra off, or whatever you got to do. But you must respect the utopia of God's favor. You understand that? Okay? We got to remember we became treasures. You understand? We became treasures. To this planet, gems, we became treasures. You understand that? Okay. So we can't, we can't, we can't be, we can't be, become aware of the treasures of this earth, of this planet. Okay. And decide we need them so bad that we're going to sell our motherfucking souls for them. Or we're going to manipulate motherfuckers. Okay? We're going to try to control or possess people. You understand? Okay? Because that's not the perfect world we're trying to get to. Okay? That's not the, that's what I'm hearing source say. Source is saying a perfect world. Okay? That's what I hear my father saying. That's not the perfect world we're trying to create. Huh? Okay? So y'all can't be a part of the collective or the 144. My whole body just got hot as hell. When I tell you a, a, a light, some heat just shot from the top of my head down to the bottom of my feet, I swear, if I had hydrohydrosis, my whole body would be soaking wet. All right, so I just want y'all to know that uh, we don't want um, to become tarnished, okay, by those things, okay? All right, we want God to continue his unconditional love for us. You understand that? We want to we want that continued. And we don't want to have that replaced with fear, okay? And be and, and induce prisons because what we're saying is not what we're actually being told to say. It's not what we're being told to do when we get on here. You understand? Um so we want to definitely not be you know induce any prisons for ourselves okay for our souls okay we don't want to do that and then our light become dark and heavy because of materialistic shit all right that's all i'm saying because god is elevating spirit y'all ancestors y'all guys they elevating y'all you know what i'm saying they are elevating the fuck out of some of y'all some of y'all ain't seeing it fast enough and that's that in it that right there it's causing y'all to enter into low vibrational states and be tempted, you understand, and, and everything. Go off into y'all uh, uh, fleshly lust more, you understand, instead of just staying in y'all. <laughs> so it's showing me that robe again. Showing me that robe again. That's all I can say. Showing me that robe again. So understand, um, we new age messengers, y'all. And we are speak. We are speaking uh, 
uh, and we are speaking and we talking, okay, to enlighten, for enlightenment, okay, to align planetary shifts, you understand that, that are ongoing, okay, and again, that's why it's a lot of shit going on right now, humanity has to suddenly wake up, and that's what, that's what Source is wanting them to do, wake the fuck up, and notice the trial of destruction that uh, it has left. You understand the trail of destruction that it has left and try to undo the damage before uh, the last glimpse of sunlight, y'all. All right? Dissipates on the horizon. You understand that? I'm going to say that again. Humanity has to suddenly wake up and notice the trail of destruction that it has left and try to undo the damage before the last glimpse of sunlight dissipates. Or dissipates, I'm sorry, dissipates on the horizon. Okay, I've been running with Jesus, running with your shower for a long time, y'all. Okay, I know how to tell the truth and shame the devil. And I also know what I'm going through. So I know, also know why I'm where I'm at in my faith right now. Okay, just know. Every day that I'm in my God body, it gets sweeter, y'all. Every day that I'm authentically in my God body, it gets sweeter, y'all. I don't mind the pitfalls. Because every time I'm, uh, I'm knee down, you understand what I'm saying? Every time I'm one knee down, you understand what I'm saying? The Holy Spirit in my assigned team is right there, y'all. All right, I'm hearing Reverend James Cleveland sing to me right now, y'all, that I don't feel no ways tired. I've come too far. You understand where I start from, where I started from, y'all. You understand that? I'm channeling Reverend, I'm channeling Mr. Cleveland, I swear. He said, nobody told me that the road be, would be easy. He said, but I won't believe he brought me this far to leave me. Hmm. My grandmother said, I want you to sing it. She said, I want you to sing that one verse for me right now. And I hate when she make me sing, y'all. Oh, God. Because I could feel her. I could feel how she feel. I could feel her, y'all. I'm sorry. But I could feel her when I sing. That's why I have this song on here because I've been trying to stay balanced. I've been trying to stay balanced, y'all. You know, and and it, and I'm I'm I, I I'm very emotional from just coming out. You know what I'm saying? Of this on here like this to keep myself clean and keep myself from doing things that I ain't got no business doing. But I just want y'all to know that it's gonna every day gonna get sweeter, y'all, when y'all stay in y'all divine purpose. But for you, mama, I don't even, I, I can hear the song. I hear them singing, but I don't know the melody of it. Uh, okay, she's showing me just one where she's, okay. I can't believe he's brought me this far to leave me. That's all I hear her saying over and over. Nobody told me that the road would be easy. But I can't believe he brought me this far to leave me. And I won't believe, y'all, that he brought me this far to leave me. I just won't believe that. Okay? I chose to return here y'all and I know I did I chose to come all this far all this way y'all to lend my light to the planet you understand to a planet y'all that's heavy with fear and sickness you understand me whether it be mental sickness 
where it be physical sickness, emotional sickness, this planet is heavy with it. And I chose to lend my light to this place. And I'm here. You hear me? I am here first to be a source and a service. You understand? Under the sacred role of leadership, y'all. This is my calling. That's my gift. You understand? Because see, the last hour of the last sunset is at hand, y'all. And I don't care if my work is unseen by the public or anybody fucking else. You understand? As long as who sent me, the great I am, the God with the big G, see me, y'all. So I just want y'all to keep lending y'all light and y'all energy. You understand? But understand, don't get jealous, don't get egotistical, don't get grandiose, don't feel no certain type of way. It ain't no competition when you're working for the Lord, you understand? It's slow and steady because that's what's going to win the race. This place didn't just get created yesterday. This, 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 didn't just, this, 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 this universe didn't just evolve yesterday, three days ago, you understand? This place been here for thousands and thousands and thousands of years. You understand that? So us as healers, you understand, with different intensities, different missions, different levels we're on. We all have to serve that common purpose for that common good. That's to elevate people's mental capacities and status as much as possible and as much as we can, as much as our God-given talents will provide for us, you understand, to walk in light. You understand? I know why y'all misunderstood. I know why y'all ridiculed. You understand? I know why y'all sometimes persecuted. I know why y'all are sometimes cast into darkness, continuously tested. You understand that? That's because y'all here in this plant on this planet and y'all roles as light bearers. You understand? We gotta painstakingly take shit, y'all, to maintain our connection to the heavens and keep ten toes down on the ground here on earth. We gotta constantly painstakingly maintain our integrity to free ourselves, to not be trapped in the virtuous torture chambers. You understand that this physical body can put us in. My son free, y'all. My friend, my son is free from virtuous torture. You understand that? My baby free from that shit. He free from virtuous torture. Do you understand that? All right, y'all loved ones is free. Y'all mothers is free from virtuous torture. Y'all fathers is free from virtuous torture. I'm getting source call out sisters and brothers. Kids, animals. Some people is in despair because of their dogs if have died. That's their family. I know I love my Chanel. I love my baby. And I wouldn't want nothing to happen to her. So I just want somebody to know that when they sleep tonight, meditate on y'all sacred role. While y'all going, while y'all, right, right when y'all get to that place where y'all can't hardly keep your eyes open. But you know that thing wants y'all to stay troubled, wants y'all to stay woke. Source wants somebody to take a sip of water and go lay they ass down. And Source said, you better start meditating when you go to bed if you got to repeat it over and over and over. You understand me? With your magical ass tongue, Source is saying. With that tongue that can create miracles. You understand that? That can manifest anything. You better ask God to help you understand your sac sacred role. And for those uh, people that's in their sacred role, y'all better make sure that y'all ask Source to give y'all everything. The tools, the grounding, what to do, the white magic, the teas, the food, whatever y'all going to use to help y'all stay in y'all sacred role. 
See, when you're in your sacred role, you do wear a robe. And that's where that robe, I keep seeing that robe from. We on the, if you're on the council, you in court, you in jury. And that's where that robe keep coming from that I keep seeing. They keep throwing that robe to me. Every time I come out here, I put that purple robe on, y'all. All right? With a whole lot of other stuff on it. And I ain't going to talk about it. But I tell you one thing. It's a lion's head helm. It's a lion's. It's a motherfucking lion's uh, uh, helmet that, that go with it. That I put over my motherfucking head. I tell you that. That's right. That's a part of the dress I heard uh, my ancestors say. Okay? So... Don't worry about feeling isolated. Don't worry about any of those things here on this earth. Light workers, healers, seers, travelers, watchers, seekers, gems. Worry about nothing. That's what I'm getting Source say. Because Source is telling y'all that y'all got a life raft. He has given y'all life rafts and he throwing them to y'all every fucking day. This is what Source is doing. Y'all are being provided life rafts. You understand? Source is saying y'all can accept that y'all living creatures. You understand? Because y'all source of energy. But what y'all need to know and y'all gotta know and that's the knowing that y'all must know that y'all got some powerful entities that dwell in every motherfucking crevice. Of this universe for y'all. You understand that? And those entities is, is what and they only entities because this is what people say that they, they are. Source got I got I got a message about that too. That entity word. I got a I got a message about that. Ooh we and it's coming, but it ain't it ain't here yet. But I got one. Okay, I ain't finished. He source ain't finished working with me with that because I'm talking to source about that. Okay, because for some reason I get a little, it, it does something to me when I hear people say that. You understand? I, it does. You know, it makes me feel like how a lot of the uh, preachers don't like really going into revelation and dissecting revelations. That bothers me. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm like, hey, tell the truth and shame the devil. The truth is the lie. If this is here, then don't, and we living in the last days, don't you think they need to be dis dissecting that instead of being worried about scaring motherfuckers? Okay? Well, right now in this world, because of the planetary shifts, those aliens and shit is sitting in people's backyards around their goddamn campfire. That's what's happening. People walking outside and they be forgetting it. They zap their ass so they don't remember shit. You understand? You understand? Ain't no man on this motherfucking planet ever been able to clone any motherfucking body without learning, without knowing about it. They got it. They got told. They got showed how to do that shit. Okay? Trust me. Just like they got show source told, just saying to me how to motherfucking get create a light bulb. You understand? They didn't. They didn't. They didn't. They didn't learn that on their own. They didn't create that shit, how to take no light and, and, and transform, it, form it into any goddamn substance. They was God divinely guided. You understand that? On how to do that. Okay? Yeah, that was them so-called entities. They taught them how to do that shit. All right? They passed that knowledge on to them. Because like I said, sources saying, yeah, everybody want light. 202 on the clock. So anyway, let me get back into this. Let me finish this up. So yes, so just know that source is where we all come from, y'all. And we, uh, where we all will eventually return. You understand that? So we better make, keep that in fucking mind. Not about the, the shoes, the clothes, the this, the that. It's that, that, um, when I tell you me being a light worker, I have always known two or three on the clock that I'm going to get what's for me. Just like what wasn't for me, it was it was it was removed from me. You understand? Or there was something, there was things that were very upsetting about that situation that source worked out. You understand? Again, that equilibrium, that balance. You know what I'm saying? It played out in my favor in the end on a lot of things, and for some of y'all as well. Okay? Source wants you guys to know that it's not like um you know, your divine frequency is not like the lights in your house where you can uh, turn it on and off. You understand that? So I just want y'all to know that um, 
you know, was what what you it's it's not like that. Okay. Um let me let me where 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 are you going with this? You giving me this. This is not on the script, but you giving me this. This is not on we we this ain't what we talked about earlier. Okay, so you coming okay, what is what's she saying? Um Okay, everything is connected through divine frequency. It's not like the lights in your house where you can turn it on and off. Or where you can turn it on and it lights up the up the house. Okay. Or you can shut it off and you can sit in darkness. Okay. I, I'm with you, Source. Come on. Okay. Source electricity is always there. That's where he going. That's where they going with that. That's man. Man. I just heard source electricity. That's that's where they're going with that. It's always there, which we know. I mean, I know, but I guess I, I have to give it to the collective. Okay, I have to talk to y'all. It's the common connection of the entire universe. That's what source is, okay? It's the const constrainable, okay? Or the or um, uh, not, not constrainable, I'm sorry. Oh, 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 oh. It's not constrained. That's what I'm getting. That time, okay? And that's time within it, past, I mean, within it, all things, okay? That's past, present, that's future, okay? It exists together. It's complete, okay? That means it also connects us with those who have died as well, okay? All right. Come on, Holy Spirit. All right. Ooh. Let's keep going. Yep. So source, uh, and again, y'all can my videos. I told y'all I'm I'm emptying, okay, and and I'm I'm getting source uh, uh, talk to me a lot, giving me teaching things. You know what I'm saying? The last 24, 48 hours, I've been getting so much, getting so many downloads, so so many science, and I I am a science. You know what I'm saying? I'm a science, not because of a degree, even though I have a science degree, but just period. You know, that's who I am, you know, in this world, the last world. And when it was new, I just heard Source say. So Source energy penetrates all objects. You understand that? So we have to, as light workers, we got to penetrate, you know, uh, uh, people. We want to penetrate them, but we don't want to pressure them. You know what I'm saying? We don't want to... Uh, uh, play them. That's what I'm. I'm hearing. I'm hearing my uh, auntie say. She said y'all don't want to play them. You know what I'm saying y'all don't want to play nobody now. Okay. You want we want them to receive our information from the energy that that sent us. Okay. Okay. Because each and every one of us, we got to remember we significant to the balance of source energy, and that's why we are chosen because source want made us significant. You understand that 144? Okay. Okay, I know I'm a light worker and I might call a prayer circle a healing circle. I might call it, you know what I'm saying? It, it, that, that, that might be natural, you know what I'm saying, for, for, for uh, me. But it might be unnatural for somebody else. You understand? Some people call it, let's get in the prayer circle. I, I, call, I say let's, before I say prayer circle, and I do use the word prayer. I use the word meditation. I use a lot of words to, to, to connect, to, that's directed at trusted source or talking to source or, you know, having an intimate relationship with source. But it's a healing circle for me when I go to source. I'm always looking for healing, healing that I don't even know I need. You understand what I'm saying, y'all? So stay in y'all collective, y'all stay in y'all divinity, please. Okay? Okay. Right. Okay. Uh, what else are the good ones? So we got to keep that in mind. And I'm getting, um, Spirit is talking about traditions. Spirit began to talk to me about traditions as well and was saying how, um, you know, how I wasn't the type of person that, I, I never was the type of person, even though I've always been a, a, a very spiritual person, I never was the type of person uh, to take my kids' belief in the, in many traditions. You understand? Whether it was Christmas or, you know, uh, the Tooth Fairy or whatever. You know what I'm saying? 
you know, I never, those traditions, you know what I'm saying, or fairy tales or whatever, or magic, you know what I'm saying, I never really, I never really pressured them into, you know, what it, the belief of, of, of a lot of shit, you know what I'm saying, I just never pressured them in it, even though, you know, they were celebratory, you know, uh, uh, things in my life, and I still celebrate certain shit, it's just different ways that I do it now, you understand what I'm saying? Because again, we are responsible for what the fuck we know. And once we know certain shit, you can't turn back from that. Don't even fucking try it. Okay? Don't even try it. Okay? Okay. You know, because I mean... I, 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 those type of beliefs, you understand? Those are... Those are those, that's, that's, that's me. That's I'm on bigger beliefs, okay? More powerful beliefs. You understand? It's like the like the power to heal. You understand? You understand the power to manifest. You know, I take those things way more serious in my life than a lot of other shit. I just do, or, or a lot of other things, okay? Because I'm by no means. You understand? Some people. I mean, Thanksgiving is one of my. Oh my God, that's one of my most prized. Uh, holidays. I love Thanksgiving. I love Easter because my birthday falls on Easter sometimes. So I be feeling like the Easter bunny or I be feeling, you know, real special. You know, it falls on Easter a lot. And um, and then I, uh, well, it has. I, I've lived a few lifetimes where it was on. Well, I've lived not a few lifetimes. Lord, what am I saying? I've lived and had a couple of birthdays that were on that were on Easter, fell on Easter. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay, and I know source that I didn't live a couple of lifetimes. Oh God, you trying to you want to tell everybody else they gonna start thinking another All right, all right. So anyway, um, but I just want source want y'all to know that it's imperative that y'all recover from any low vibrational states that y'all in. That y'all seek out different ways of cleansing yourself because some of y'all that took on so much. You understand? It's that, 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 like how I just take the incense and go around in a circle and all, uh-uh, because -uh, it's a salo. No, sometime y'all going to need some much, much different things, okay? And, and again, source of guide, y'all. Source of guide, y'all, okay? There's somebody out there right now that need, a, uh, need some money and sources uh, telling me that uh, to tell that person, uh, to just go get a, to go buy a green crayon and they'll know what to do with it when they get it. Go get a green, go buy a green crayon and you'll know what to do once you get the green crayon. And I, I and that's all they left me with. I don't, I don't know any mysteries or anything that's being given to you. Any secrets? Any besides that? I was only given that. Okay, you need some money for a few things, so I want y'all to go out and uh. Get a green crown, and y'all supposed to know what to do with the green crown after that. I don't know what the what it is, what's, what else is going on. Okay, I'm not getting any cant uh, cantations or anything like that. So, um, just know miracles do occur, y'all. Okay, and when we access light, okay, energy from source, we're able to uh, call them down. That's what Source is saying. Okay? Dark energy is all about negative thoughts and emotions. You understand that? So we got to get away from that. We can't be putting that out there. Okay? We can't be taking it in from these motherfuckers and not cleaning ourselves the way we supposed to. Okay? Dark energy ain't the same as... Uh, it ain't the same thing as evil, y'all. I just want y'all to know that. I repeat, I'm going to repeat what dark energy is. Dark energy is all about negative thoughts and emotions with intention. It's not the same thing as evil. Okay? Y'all got to learn how to properly manage uh, dark energy. Okay? That's your thoughts and your emotions. Okay? Because they can accelerate on y'all. Okay? Okay? Y'all gotta y'all gotta manage that dark energy so it don't accelerate and cause y'all to again be demoted and become the 140 motherfucker three. All right, 213 on the clock. Cause y'all gotta y'all y'all I mean I ain't talking to nobody that don't know that evil is energy. Okay. 
And that energy is acted on uh, on with intention. You understand? Okay, so y'all know that. Okay, like murder and shit like that. Motherfuckers want to unalive your ass. Okay? Okay? Now, don't let me leave out that both dark and light energy, they equally accessible, y'all. Okay? They equally accessible to us. So we got to keep that in mind. Okay, we have to act, we can access the power of either one. And we, that's what I'm saying. We already know you got people accessing this and people accessing that. All right. And they doing it with intention to, to either heal or harm. Okay. And we want to encourage people to use, assess uh, that, that, that source energy Okay, assess that to heal. Okay, and 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 not just themselves, cause that's what's gonna heal the earth. Okay. Okay. Remember, intentions are the originators of our actions, y'all. They are the originators of our actions, and they have a much greater effect than most people realize. Okay, the intention affects the energy more than the action. Keep that in mind. So it says, say it again. The intention effect, uh, uh, effect, the intention affects the energy more than the action. Okay. So remember the intention uh, uh, of something good. More than likely, that's what you get. Okay. Because source energy, it lives within all of us. I'm going to say that again. And in, uh, an intention, not action, is what creates the biggest shift in source energy. Okay? Keep that in mind. Okay? We have a world um, that's uh, bigger than, uh, you know, we can imagine. This universe is so many uh, mysteries, so many things for us to learn about ourselves inside. But source wants y'all to know, you understand, that that's what y'all are. Y'all are beacons of light. Y'all are energy. You know what I'm saying? And our world is, uh, is is way more energetic than most of us realize, okay? So we got to become uh, what we what we see ourselves because, and, and, and that has to be something good because that's what's going to manifest, okay? All right? Source is saying just because y'all can't see it, okay, with y'all physical eyes don't mean it ain't so, Okay? And that's case in point. You can't see gravity either, can you? All right. You only see its effect, right? All right, then. So in other words, source wants y'all to know you reap what you sow. Okay? Basically. So y'all um, have a great night. Love you much. Thank you for sitting with me. I have... Uh, I'm working on some uh, information for you guys because um, uh, I got a lot of uh, downloads uh, for some things. Uh, I want to go off into um, the name of Planet Earth, the Eridu. I also want to talk about the third eye, the point of G to y'all guys. And I also want to break down Solomon as well. Okay. All right, I want to break down Solomon, okay? Because right now, a lot of people need to realize that self-realization, that's who this, that's, that's what the seeker is. You understand? You can't be no seeker of light, love, truth, any, 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 other, any other components, any other strengths, okay? Without having self-realization. That's like the, that's the hierarchy, okay? That's the hierarchy. That's the top of the pyramid, all right? And we want to keep that in mind, you know, because again, like I said, I prefer wisdom, okay? All right? I prefer wisdom to riches, kingdoms, and fame. I want y'all to know that. I'll take the wisdom because I can have all that with that, okay? That's easy to obtain. And when and, and then that's a, you rather have the wisdom because you can lose all that other shit uh, and what you gaining. Y'all take care, all right? I want y'all to have a good night. Okay, I'm working on, uh, uh, I'm, get, I'm still getting some uh, downloads and I'm researching some things right now so that I can talk to y'all about the golden land, y'all. 
the holy land, okay? A new Egypt in America, because it's coming. Y'all have a good day, a good night, a good uh, afternoon, wherever y'all is. 2.19 on the clock. Love you. Bye-bye.